Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and honeygirlsworld.com. If you are new here, hello there. I am Honey and I am the face that you're going to be seeing around here. Um, if you are not new here and you've been a while for been around for a while, welcome back you guys. Thanks so much for joining me. It is a beautiful Thursday day and I'm a little bit late getting this um started. Um, we are kind of got a hybrid learning thing going on right now. So I had to run one of my sons to school. Um, but it is thirsty Thursday. So if you are new here and you're not familiar with my thirsty Thursdays, these are just kind of days where I do a little chit chat and you join me with your drink and snack of choice. Today's drink is my coffee. Um, with some um, of my Premier Protein Shake mixed in. So if you're going to be joining me, make sure you get yourself a beverage, um, drink safely if you're having an alcoholic beverage, and cheers! So let's go ahead and get started with a little chit chat today. Um... I know my Thirsty Thursday videos have been kind of long lately, so I'm going to try not to make this too long, but I kind of wanted to share a little bit of info, and I'm sorry, I kind of got all my pillows just kind of thrown on the bed behind me, but I wanted to kind of chit-chat and share with you guys what I've been up to the last week, what I've been prepping for. If you've watched a few of my other videos you may have seen that I finally released my Patreon um, and so this past week I was going through and sending out all my mailings for my Patreon members um, or those people that had signed up get that done. My Patreon is going to be very similar to a monthly subscription service like Ipsy or um, whatever other ones are out there, FabFitFun or what have you. So you'll sign up for a certain tier that will provide you with different types of happy mail and you will get sticker sheets or and like a postcard, a greeting card, something along those lines and a number of different things. So I'm going to show you guys some of the sticker sheets that I had excuse me oh my goodness um and i will leave the link to my patreon listed down below but i'll go ahead and show you a few things that i have so with it being november i actually wanted to include at least one of these and sorry about the glare um these are hand drawn if you are from Hawaii or familiar with that, I have the Ohia Lehua Blossom um, as well as some taro and taro leaves. These are hand drawn by me, put onto a sticker sheet, um, and that's one of those. And then I also have my Plumeria sticker sheet. So each month, depending on what tier you're on, you'll get one or two sticker sheets. And it'll allow you to just go ahead and have some fun. And then I also included a um, November Thanksgiving sticker sheet because it should get there in enough time. Um, I did use this one, but this is a little sneak peek of some of the things here. So this is kind of just deco um, going on. And I use them in my planner for this month's layout so that's that um i also wanted to show you guys kind of a little sneak peek as to what's going to be included in next month december's box so you're going to get a again these are hand-drawn flowers by me um this sticker sheet as well as a december themed sheet so all mail outs go out the first week of November. I like to send them out by the first. Um, and then you get free desktop and mobile wallpaper. Not free, but included in some of your tiers um, that I have available every month. You get a, access to my printables that um, can be downloaded that I actually charge per printable. But 
they are basically part of your um, a vaulted area, kind of a chest area where you can go and download those for free instead of paying for them. So like I said, this is a sneak peek for next month. These are my hand-drawn magnolias. So I draw them out and then I digitize them. Sometimes I draw them directly on my phone or tablet, um, but I do like those. You'll also get a little freebie signature bowl um, vinyl sticker this month as well as other goodies. So I just kind of wanted to share that. Um, the Christmas holiday sticker for this month or for the beginning of December is super cute. Let me pull that out. So I'm going to be sending out again some holiday deco so you can get a number of different things, um, a number of different types of sheets. So I'll either send out the pink or the turquoise, super cute, right? Pink or turquoise um, sheets. And these are matte, printed on matte sticker paper. So I'm super excited about these. They're all kiss cut, ready to go for you to put into your planner or decorate as you would like. Uh, I've also been working on some merch. So um, some of my signature bows you will see on t-shirts as well as my hand-drawn um, sunflowers. Some of these you guys will see I have available in my Amazon store as well as through my Rare Breed site. I've been uploading those and having those available so you guys can go ahead and take part in that. Um, and then this month as well, I also have some fun bookmarks. Um, featuring my drawings so you'll receive one bookmark depending on what tier you get it's part of the goodies so I have this is hand drawn by me and then I'm not too sure if it'll pick it up but it is foil hand drawn by me and um, foiled so I will be choosing out a design to send in your care package for December just some goodies for you to start the new year and stuff like that um, again these are my own hand-drawn designs and just fun fun things to to have so a little bookmark here as well um, so yeah so patreon again like I said I really wanted to turn it into a monthly subscription service and kind of maybe not monthly subscription service it's kind of a bad um representation of that but monthly subscription where you guys can sign up and get a bunch of goodies every month i enjoy those so therefore i did that and i did change my tiers around i removed some of the higher tiers um so those of you that have signed up already you may have noticed that you were pushed down to a lower tier but it's still one affordable two you still get all the goodies um i also wanted to share with you guys i talked about having a smaller everything planner available so this is the everything planner mini this is kind of just about a five by seven size a little bit smaller this one is not available through amazon um but you can go to honeygirlsworld.com and actually find it it's got a different layout from the everything planner so the weeklies look like this it's small, but perfect for you, kind of like a field notes pocket type um, planner. And I wanted to be able to provide that with a little bit of a different color from the traditional planner. I don't know where my everything planner is right now, but that's that. And um, I did go ahead and finally get my orders and proofs for my two coloring books so i wanted to share that with you guys this is my secret forever garden edition 2 this one features all of my artwork in here so um just different types of pages with drawings this is what's on the bookmark just different types of drawings that i've done um I'm not going to do a complete flip through, but it is an adult coloring book. 
And then I also have my mandala coloring book. This one, again, is hand-drawn by me. And it includes different mandala designs. That you can color to your heart's content. And you get 50 pages in here as well. So I will leave the link down below for these. Um, I talked about them in previous videos. But I will leave the link down below for those as well. I also wanted to touch base with you guys with regards to my gray hair journey. Um, I have two ring lights on right now. So hopefully the light is pretty similar to what it's supposed to be. But this is where my gray has grown out. I actually went in, we're in November. So I'm going to say in August, maybe September, I like lightened up my roots a little bit more and my hair apparently grew out already but the gray hair had grown in a lot a lot a lot it's starting to look a little bit more like blended is it showing um i actually need to go and tone my hair some more um, I still have some gray left over from when I did the gray over color. It just didn't come out of my hair. Um, and then you can see some warmth throughout my hair as well. I'm actually going to go in and probably lighten my roots again one more time and do some gray. I will be honest, fall and winter months is normally when I go purple or red. And this is going to be um interesting to see how i can withstand that because i'm not going red because it took so long to get all of that out and to go purple um i might be able to do like a light a lighter purple than darker i just don't want to be you know struggling with the color left behind and then i have to restart all over again so you do see some browns like i said i kind of went in and lightened it a little bit my gray is growing out a lot on my root section you can see that big patch like right here um it is growing out a lot but it's not it it is growing out in streaks and patches and as i stated before in other videos when i talked about my gray hair journey i didn't expect that that would happen i assumed that it would just keep it would all grow gray and then you know it would eventually blend out and it really did not work that way so i am honestly kind of you know tripping out so to say because i'm like oh my god like i'm just tripping on that but at the same time i think it is still pretty cool and like it doesn't look as crazy thankfully because of this now mind you my hair is starting to grow back in dark in my roots and then you're seeing the streaks whether or not I'm going to let it go or just keep lightening it at this point, I really don't know. But I think ultimately, um, it I really like being light. See, see my roots? Like, no matter how much I color them, my hair just grows really fast. Um, I really like the light color in my hair. And... I'm thinking I might, like I said, refresh, go back in, lighten my roots again and let it go and just kind of try to go as light as possible so that I can put like a lavender in and or grays. But I will be honest, I do truly miss having darker hair. So, you know, it's kind of a touch and go and it could just be because I have so much warmth in my hair right now and I do need to tone it that that's why I'm kind of like, oh, I miss my dark hair. But I mean, overall, I've been dealing with it. It works for me for the most part. Um, I do notice that my curls are 
much more pulled out. They're not as defined as they used to be. And it could just be because we're on COVID. I really just don't do anything with my hair other than kind of wash and go or throw it up in a pineapple or in a bun. That's kind of been the gist of it. Um, or leave it down. I don't put a lot of product in it. I haven't been really focused on too much. So that could be it. Um, I also wanted to share. Give me one second. I also talked about this in my previous video. If you haven't watched it yet, I'll go ahead and put it in the card somewhere up here um, where I talked about and kind of reviewed and did a show and tell on my order from Free Prints. That was just prints. Um, I did talk about a canvas that was coming in and this is the canvas that I ordered. It's a picture of my husband and I. Um, the canvas is really nice. I went ahead and reviewed a canvas from Canvas Discount, which I really enjoy. The quality of Canvas Discount is really nice. But I got this for free. I paid shipping, and I believe the shipping was $13 to $15. Not too sure. I will put it in the description. Um, it's really nice. It You aren't able to choose your thickness, but it's really thick. It's black all around. And then the back is just really nice. It comes ready to mount. So if you're looking at signing up for free prints or anything like that, I will also leave the link down below where I can get extra prints every month. Um, if you decide to sign up and check it out, I highly suggest checking this out. It might be a little bit too late. You might only be able to get a canvas for this month and maybe next month. This did take um, about two weeks to come in. But at the same time, or maybe a week and a half. Yeah, just about two weeks. Um, but I only paid for shipping and it is really nice, you guys. So I highly, highly suggest checking it out. It is just a really nicely well-made. I love the sturdiness of it. So this would be perfect as a holiday gift um, if you sign up and get it now. So I'm actually going to look into ordering one as well. So yeah, canvas. Uh, freeprints.com um, <sighs> so I am getting ready for the new year I said this before in past videos but I'm super super excited or proud of myself I shall say because I did utilize my bullet journal all year we are now in November I have two months about left of the year and I've been in a bullet journal. Now I did have to switch bullet journals. I'm in my second one for the year because I ran out of space in my other one, but I'm super proud of that. Um, right now I'm currently in my Scribbles That Matter um, bullet journal. This is a hard cover and I have been busy writing in that. I journal a little bit and do a little bit of things in there. So if you guys are interested in having like a journal with me video or anything like that, definitely let me know. Um, as I stated before, I'm not going to keep you guys too long because my last videos were quite hefty. Um, again, my Patreon will be listed down below. If you guys just want to kind of sign up and, um, you know, get some downloadables every month or get happy mail every month with a number of different things the link will also be listed down below i just i want to have a little planner group of people who enjoy planner stickers stationery all those kinds of things i have a number of different things that i'm working on and i just wanted to share it with you guys um and yeah i said a lot of um today I just could not think of anything to talk about, but I know I wanted to do a video and try to get that up for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Thanks so much, you guys, for joining me here today on this Thirsty Thursday where we did a little chit chat. Um, I've been very, very active on my podcast, which I think you guys realize and know because my podcast listens have been really, really good. Um, so if there is anything you want me to discuss on my podcast, definitely let me know. We were talking about um, mindful habits, productivity, common core was my last episode. And 
it got a lot of good traction. I think you guys really enjoyed that. So if there's anything particular you want me to touch base on, it's kind of like my Thirsty Thursdays in that it is a chit chat type of um, platform where it's just talking story and there's no set anything. Kind of talking story, sharing my thoughts. My sister, Harmony, which you've seen here on my channel before, has joined me, I think, on the last three and it's been really good. So if you guys are interested in that, definitely head on over and check it out. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you haven't already, definitely hit that subscribe button on the way out. Click the notification bell, smash it all, and hang out and talk story with me. For those of you that have been here before or are longtime subscribers, thanks so much again for coming back. I hope you guys are having the most wonderful Thursday. If you are joining me and you have a drink of choice, cheers to you. I hope you guys have a wonderful day and are prepped and ready for the weekend. And I'll talk to you guys all soon. See you later, all. Bye.